Welcome back. We're in the kitchen. We're all wearing bibs. Yes, Diane yep. Gotsman is with us. Also, Daniel Farias from the Palm Restaurant. And we're having a little lesson in etiquette this morning. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. And Daniel is going to teach us how to crack a lobster today. <laughs> you know, we should... This is something we should all know. It's kind of like changing a tire. We should know how to do it, but once right. you have to do it, it's hard. So, so, And this can apply to a lot of different foods because anytime you're in a situation where you feel uncomfortable because you don't know how to eat it, like, you know, ribs, it's all over here, yeah. or escargot, Gargo, which I would I haven't eaten yet, but just in case, I would want to know how to eat those, That's right. right? So we're going to give you some simple tips that you can use when you go anywhere so you, you feel good about eating this ginormous lobster. Where do we start? Oh, wait, hold, hold up. we got to <laughs> say something. Daniel, these are the biggest lobsters I've ever seen in my life. They I'm are. So these are four-pound lobsters. Good And uh, this is what the Palm normally serves on a daily basis. So. I love this. Where have I been? I haven't been to the Palm lately, apparently, because I didn't know how to eat lobster. I was going to be embarrassed. Well, the I'm first thing you have to remember out. is when it comes to etiquette with laughter, it's more about fun and just enjoying yourself. Even so when I'm at the right. Palm, it's okay? Especially when you're at the Palm. But my worst nightmare is like squirting someone at the other table <laughs> with some lobster. And it's going to be me. Yeah. Right yeah. Now, <laughs> and then you're like, oh. <laughs> well, the good news is at the Palm, we do it for you. Uh, nobody gets dirty but ourselves. So don't, oh, worry, so don't worry about that part. Okay. okay. Uh, but as far as cracking the lobsters, now normally I would do this at the table, or, or the service would do this at the table with, uh, with na white napkins so okay. we don't touch your food directly. But for the purpose of this afternoon, uh, I'm going to kind of do it bare hands here. So we're following I'm, you? Right. So, like, I'm yeah. at a lobster dinner, which is, you know, so, that happens a lot. Which you got the bib on, so you're good to go. That's right. I place. put on my bib. Then I get my cracker. My, right. Do I have to use this? Well, the, the, cra this? the cracker we don't really use. The white napkins are, like I said, uh, if you don't want to get yourself, you know, dirty. Okay. Um, but so, okay, so we're going in it up with our yeah. hands. Oh. Get, oh, get one I just did. <laughs> that, that's how easy it is. It really Delish. is. Okay. Okay, yeah. wait. I didn't mind. Mine didn't pop off like just that. snap it off. Snap it off. First thing is just snap off one of the little arms. Oh, okay. So this there you go. It's already see, flying okay. off. Okay. Here's a problem, Daniel. Look what happened. Well, and that's okay. Now I have to dig. Well, that's okay. That's what these little bad boys are for. Okay. They, the little cocktail forks help you There's get the meat out, okay. out of the top, okay. out of the so rough spots. what happens, I've got this big piece right here. Mm -hmm. I'm using my fork for the whole thing. Well, the first thing is uh, actually, you the best we, need to, we, need to, we need to Hold break off the thumb. <laughs> we need to break off the thumb better. of the lobster. That's where that's why it's so difficult. So you kind of you move it back and forth. I took the good piece. There she just go. took my thumb. I know, sorry. Okay. This, all right. Okay. Wait. And then you just kind of, there you go. This yeah. is a big lobster. A little He's bit of a workout sometimes. He's strong. One, two, three. Let's okay, do like the wishbone. Well, actually, tell you what. Actually, oh, one yeah. of the <laughs> one of the fun parts is Whoopsies. just you know for making it easier is rather than trying going back and forth, try to go sideways. Okay. Uh, the 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 shell of the lobster is weaker in that, so well, it's a little I bit easier to come, come out. to dinner at the Palm. I have a reservation this. already made oh, for you. Oh, good God! Look at this, you guys. You oh. got. The Other than that. Oh. It just slipped out. Oh. What about mine? She gave me the, the little bitty one here. So well, there you go. Okay, okay, well, okay. Well, there's a big one on yours, too, somewhere on that platter. Okay. Now, so, so is it good etiquette to just yes. do this real quick? Certainly. You can use your fingers, because it's kind of finger food. Mm. And it's fun, you know. Mm. Oh, my God. And continue to crack on the lobster. I mean, just... Segment's over. Let's just have okay. lobster. <laughs> so let's keep going. So once we okay. get through... This part. Through can once you, you, once you can use your hand. hands? Yeah. How much, how much meat is there? So it's in here? Out of every pound of lobster, you get approximately three or four ounces of meat. Mm. So on a four-pound lobster like this, you're getting about almost a full pound of, of meat out of your lobster. I see another danger zone here. Is there anything in this thumb? Is there anything in here? <laughs> uh, yes, there is. And that's where you get your cocktail fork and try to, you know, try to scrape some out. Uh, and oh. the arm of the lobster... That's where, again, you, you can crack those bad boys up. These right here? Use, yeah. your, use your cocktail fork. I know there's some good stuff in this tail. That That's where a lot, of, a lot of the flavor is. You can literally crack the, the body oh. up if you want. Woo! There you go. I love this. Just did it. So remember, just crack it in half? Yeah, if just you want, pull. Just pull, pull it across. This is where Yank Diane it. gets squirted. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, why we have, that's why we have the, the, the oh bibs on there, ladies. But what about right this stuff? This, is that the tamale? Now, yes. Wait a minute. We have oh, an emergency. There you go. That's, that's, the tamo that's the tamale. We have, we have an emergency over here. <laughs> Clean that's up called, on aisle four. What is this? That's tamale, and not our Mexican food tamale. Yes. It's this green stuff. Is called. I don't, what is it? Do I want to eat that? No. It's the, it's the innards of the lobster. Some people consider it delicatessen. I'm not showing it to Make you. Make your choice. She really? got it on my face. Uh-oh. Sorry. Well, here's a lot of amino acids. For now today. what? Okay. Uh, but other than that, this is why you never order a lobster on a job interview. You know, right here. Oh, good. Okay. So here's, here's the okay. here's the big piece. Like I said, okay. at, the, at the restaurant we did this for you. But here's the big piece that everybody loves: <gasps> the the oh. tail of the lobster. Okay. 
And there you go. You got that full full thing right there ready to go. I'm oh, a little sidetracked nice. by the tamale. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of caught me off guard here. Okay. We got more, more of me coming out here from this claw on, on my left. Okay, so, t so tell us about these legs. Is there anything in the legs? There, we... there is. Uh, it's oh, it's more left me there. You actually just twist them off. Yeah. Uh, and then oh. twist them, twist them open, oh, yeah. and you literally suck the meat out. It's called sucking leg. Uh, oh, sucking leg. Sucking leg. It's a fun. It's like right a straw. Here. You can have, here. Here's one for you. Break, it, break it up and uh, just suck the, suck the meat out. It's certainly part of the fun parts. Oh. Uh, and also in the body of the lobster, wanting to do a little more work out of it, there is meat in there to enjoy as well. So hey. there's a lot, a lot of meats. Uh, you would suck this eaten. meat out here. Yep. Okay. So here's the story. At the palm, they do this for you, so you don't have to worry about it. But you still get the bib, though, right? You get the bib. One thing to remember: no lobster on a job interview. Or a, date. <laughs> not or a date. Not a first date. And not a first date, but like a second date. To I'm totally into that. Well, so here's your first date right here. Oh, oh my yes. gosh. <laughs> you can find Diane at the Protocol School of Texas on Austin Highway. PSOTX.com. DianeGotsman.com. The phone number there as well. I'm coming to the Pearl very soon. Oh my gosh, this is delicious. All right, guys. <sighs> very Don't cute. go away.